multiplication patterns with decimals. Let's take a look at a few examples. We can see that in each example, one factor is always 0.25. The other factors are powers of 10. 1, 10, 100, and 1000. Let's take a look at what happens when you multiply a decimal by powers of 10. When you multiply a factor by 1, the number stays the same. When we multiply a factor by 10, the decimal point moves one place to the right. If we multiply a number by 100, the decimal point moves two places to the right. If we multiply by 1000, the decimal point moves three places to the right. As you can see, you get a pattern. When the number has one zero, we move the decimal point one place to the right. When the number has two zeros, we move the decimal point two places to the right. When the number has three zeros, we move the decimal point three places to the right, and so on. But what happens when we multiply a number by one tenth or one hundredth? Let's take a look at two examples. Each example has 25.3 as a factor. In the first example, we multiply by one tenth. When you multiply by one tenth, the decimal point moves one place to the left. In the next example, we multiply by one hundredth. When you multiply by one hundredth, the decimal point moves two places to the left. Let's take a look at a few examples. Take a look at the first example. The first factor is one tenth. We move the decimal point one place to the left to get 6.81. Now let's do the next example. The factor is 100. 100 has two zeros, so we move the decimal point two places to the right. We get 73.5. Let's do the next example. The first factor is 10 to the power of 3. That's the same as saying 1,000. 1,000 has three zeros, so we move the decimal point three places to the right. We get 670. Let's do the next example. The factor is 100th. We move the decimal point two places to the left. We get 2.64. Let's do the last example. The factor is 10 to the power of 2. That's the same as saying 100. 100 has two zeros, so we move the decimal point two places to the right. We get 2,374. If you thought this video was helpful, please leave a like. For more videos like this, please subscribe.